Hey guys, hope you're doing well. Welcome to this video. In this video, I'm going to talk about a few important things if you want to run Facebook ads for your business or if you're doing Facebook ads for someone who owns a business. So this video will basically cover how to set up your Facebook business manager, how to set up your Facebook ads manager, how to connect your Facebook page, your Instagram profile and getting everything prepared for running ads. I know this is a really important step because a lot of people get really confused about what a business manager is, what the role of a business manager and ad manager is in this process. And I'll tell you, it's really important to know and I'll tell you, it's really important to get everything clear before you start running your first campaign. So in this video, I'm gonna give you a detailed overview with a specific use case, uh, which you get to know once you start watching the video in the middle. So make sure you watch this full video and understand this full process before you start running ads. Uh, watch the full video and I'll see you on my computer screen. All right, now we'll start setting up our Facebook business manager. In order to do that, we will go to a page called business.facebook.com. So again, just see it business.facebook.com. As soon as we go to this page, it will bring us to a page like this. And that's the meta business suite. Okay, that's done and make sure you have the right page selected and that's going to be your business page in this case i'm using this page for now and if you click on this drop down it's gonna show you that you don't have a business account right now now in most cases this this will be the layout or this will be how you see it in some cases you may have a business manager set up already because facebook sometimes creates a business manager by default when you're creating the Facebook page. In case you don't have a business manager created already, you have to create one by clicking here, create a business account. So I'm going to create a business account that says, M, and it's going to be my name and my email. Okay. So these are the things you need business name, first name, last name, and business email. As soon as you hit create, it's going to go ahead and create the business account for you or the business manager for you. So it's basically the same, same thing, business account, business manager. And uh, once you are done creating the business account, it's going to ask you whether or not you want to connect your Facebook page with the business account, right? So make sure you hit click on this checkbox. So by clicking this checkbox, you are basically adding your page to the business account, hit next. And in this step, it's going to ask you if you want to add an employee or something to your business account, which I'm not going to do. So I'm going to hit next, confirm, that's all. And in most cases, it will uh, show you that your business account is uh, not allowed to advertise. So it, because it, it sometimes restricts your account that you, uh, and you need to verify. So just go to settings. Just go to business settings from here. So this is the business suite settings, right? You need to go to the actual business settings and make sure you are under this. And if you cannot see anything here, you need to click on this. It's going to take you to a request review page. So I'm going to basically request for review that the business manager I created is authentic, you know, all those stuff. And I'm, I'm really glad that this happened because I can finally show you, uh, because most of you will face this issue, right? And uh, I'm going to just enter my details here. All right, guys, so as soon as I hit submit with my phone number, and it, it just sent me a code, it's going to ask you to, you know, upload an authentic ID, so a driver license or, you know, a passport or something, just to prove that this business account that you have created is authentic. So don't worry, it, it gets resolved within an hour after uploading it and you should be able to start, uh, you know, with your regular setup after that. So I'm going to now upload my passport after pausing this video. So as soon as I uploaded my passport, it says you'll hear back from us within 48 hours. Although I know that's not the case because I've done it like multiple times and I know it gets resolved within a few minutes, maybe an hour or maybe two hours. It doesn't take that long. And after it gets resolved, I'll be able to show you, uh, I'll be able to show you the regular setup after that. All right, guys. So it literally took like two minutes for uh, like reinstating my account. So now you can see there is no restriction. I've uploaded my ID. I've verified my number. One more thing you need to do is when you go to business settings like this, or I'll show you how to do it from here, from the suit. So 
just go to business settings you need to go to business info and you basically need to verify your email so if you haven't verified already it's going to ask you to send a code and send a code to your email click on that link that's all it's going to verify that email address for you so that's all you need to do for business manager setup now let's go to head over to pages and let's add our page so i'm going to add a new page i'm going to call I'm going to just start writing the page down because uh, I'm an admin of this page. So it's going to show it up on top Add page because I'm an admin of the page and the business manager. It's not going to cause any issues. It's going to add my page to this business account right away. So what we have done so far is we have created a business manager. We attempted to create uh, or we attempted to add our page to that business manager, but the ad business manager was restricted. We requested for a review and asked facebook to re-enable the business manager which it was done like within two minutes and then now we have added our page now let's head over to instagram accounts and if you hit add connect your instagram account it's going to ask you to log into your instagram and connect it with this so i'm going to basically connect my own uh, own instagram here just to give you an example, you need to just put your username and password and it's going to uh, it's going to log in, log you in and connect your Instagram account with this business manager. In this case, it's not going to be your personal Instagram. I prefer like adding the business Instagram here. So it's it's causing issues because I'm not an admin. So that's just fine. Uh, when you add your Instagram business, it's going to it's going to work like a charm and you know it's gonna connect your instagram profile with the with the ad account right so let's just jump right into ad accounts that's the final step in this uh part so we'll just uh create a new ad account and if we call it this the time zone needs to be correct so i'm i'm because i'm in a different location so i'm gonna select my own time zone it, in your case it will be different and so let me just select the right uh, right time zone and currency. Guys, this is really important. You need to select the appropriate time zone and currency. It needs to match. And in this step, I will select my business. That's fine. It's going to go ahead and create the ad account for me. And now it's asking me to assign all these on myself. Otherwise, I won't be able to manage this ad account, even though I created the business manager. But they want me to individually assign access to this ad account on myself, which I've done. Now it's going to ask me to add a payment info, which you can do later. So that's done. So, so far we have created this business manager. We have re-enabled it after Facebook restricted it. Then we, uh, we created or we added our page because it, uh, I was an admin of this page. I was able to add it to this business manager. Then we also saw how to connect Instagram, uh, to this business manager because my Instagram is connected with the business manager already. It didn't happen but in your case as, as long as the instagram uh, is not connected to any business manager it should be okay then finally we created the ad account and now because i have assigned this ad account uh, access to myself if i click on open in ads manager it should take me to the ad manager portal where i can actually create the ads right and if you want to add your payment method you just need to head over here, select the ad manager, view payment methods, come over here that says payment methods, and you need to modify permissions. You need to say assign to myself. So you're basically assigning yourself as a finance editor of this ad account. And then you can add a payment method here. Finally, you can add your card details. And that's how you will be charged for the money you spend for the ads, right? So that's it for the setup part.